Hello everyone, so right now it's around like 2 o'clock in the afternoon, we're over here at a uh, buffet, I think it's like a vermicelli buffet, we'll see how much it costs to eat, I'm not quite sure what the price is, but we're going to eat here and then after this we're going to walk to maybe the old city to kind of get ready for the lantern festival event, so it's going to be epic. Uh, so they got some jello dessert. Tapioca stuff. What is that? Nam Neo, which is a so northern red curry. Red curry. Mm. Whoa, look at that. Okay. This one is red curry chicken. Red curry chicken. Yeah, that's how it looks like. Oh, hold it. This one is sweet and sour bean curry. See, it's pretty popular. Next one, you have jungle fish curry. Jungle fish curry? Coconut. This is kabong. Is it? Yes, this is my one. We haven't checked this one. That one is green, green curry. curry. Yum. Might want to get that one. Green curry, you guys. How's it taste like? It's good. It's good. All right. So we finished our uh, bowl. I finished my green curry noodles now I got the red curry same thing but red curry and maybe a little bit more like spicier so we'll see how that goes okay so this place costs about 79 baht per person so that's around two bucks per person for an all you can eat of capone fudge over here they have about six different type of drop and a few uh, appetizers and uh, snacks. They also have like a uh, jelly tapioca dessert. So out of this whole um, you know experience what, what was the best dish? I like the northern um, blood pork tomato Thing. Soft. Like, I thought it was my favorite. Like, I really like this and I like this. I, I, I think neither one of them were, were good. <laughs> this place is a fail. What? <laughs> <laughs> I think I like I like this place. I like this place the best. Just dessert. Okay, so we just got done eating at the buffet. I have to say that you know it was actually pretty disgusting. I think it was just all like hype that it's all you can eat capone or vermicelli but the broth is pretty disappointing i mean you could come try it out for yourself but i wouldn't really recommend coming over here because 
everything's kind of cold like the noodles cold the broth is like okay it's like a little warm so yeah, then when you mix it with the noodles it's actually really cold yeah so yeah. i think it would have been better if the broth was like really hot so that way it'll act you can really taste the um the broth and the um, everything Mayping River. I think it's where uh, it's the main spot to be over here at the Lantern Fest. They're gonna light up all their Lloyd Cartons right here on the river and maybe lighting up some uh, lanterns over here. So this is not a private event. They're not going to like light everything up at the same time. And so you light it up like at your own pace. Yeah. So it's gonna be like very, it's gonna vary throughout the skies right here and also. Um, you know, we're doing more of a local thing, I guess. It's free. I feel like the picture perfect place that you want to be at would be the private, but it's way too expensive. Yeah, it's not even um, something traditional that they do. They just have that private event. For, so they can make money. Yeah, to make money. <laughs> but anyways, if you want to buy a lantern, just buy over here. It's pretty cheap. I think it's only about thirty bucks, so that's like almost a dollar for each lantern. Same goes for the uh, Loi Kong where you float in the uh, in the water. It's also like a dollar each. Thank you guys very much for watching and I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you enjoy it, don't forget to like and subscribe. Uh, more videos coming up soon. Thank you guys again once again. Peace out.